pointed out earlier, David, too, because these three people are charged and will be appearing in federal court, uh, you don't know if investigators don't want to tip their hand in terms of the charges, if they'll spell out exactly what they were not forthcoming about, because you don't know if there are, in fact, other people beyond this who might have knowledge or who might have had conversations with Johar. We have this days. picture now, Paula, that we want to pop up. It's a picture that you have seen over the past couple of days. Uh, Johar Sarnayev on the right. In the middle is Diaz Karabayev, one of the people who is now in custody. We are told the person on the left is Azamat Tazhayakov. Now, this picture, and you can't really see it here on the tight shot, was taken in Times Square. And of course, we learned just a couple of days ago from Mayor Bloomberg down in Times Square that the plan had been, according to what Johar had told investigators, sort of spontaneously on that Thursday night going into Friday was to drive down to Times Square and possibly pull off an attack there as well. And it's interesting just to see, coincidentally or not, the picture of all three of these people standing in the middle of Times Square. Again, Johar on the right, Diaz in the middle, Azamat on the left. Uh, those two suspects on the left in court this morning on immigration charges, uh, visa charges having to do with their student visas. Now this afternoon will, according to sources, what they're telling our I team and what they've been telling CBS News, that they'll be back in court on um, charges of obstructing justice. And what we can learn from just looking at the charges themselves, although they haven't been made official, is that you're not seeing any type of terror charge here, no. which tells you that uh, from what prosecutors believe, they didn't know anything ahead of time or else there would have been some type of terror charge. Sure. Uh, that in fact, after this all went down, they just didn't answer the questions the way they should have, at least according to the investigators in the case. Right. The cho charges so far tell us that these were people who were questioned by investigators who, as we see from this photograph, clearly were friends of his uh, with whom he traveled. And as we go back to uh, Beth Germano, who's standing by at the federal courthouse, 